welcome to get rich or die day six. As you can see, uh, overnight I put some torches in our little uh, humble abode here, and oh well, uh, today's gonna be another selling day, making some more money. Uh, currently starting off at 2,292 dukes. Um, don't know why I have that wood there, but we're gonna be selling off all this stuff. Uh, for, uh, for some moolah, like the flashlights so were a good chunk of change, uh, and along with the leather and everything. And looking out at the farm, it's looking alright for now. But with all that being said, we're I'm gonna I'm gonna get on the road, and we're actually not gonna go see Trader Bob uh, over here at. We're actually going to go see these two traders. Uh, give us a little bit of lifeblood. So, with all that being said, so, I'm going to get on the road and uh, I will be with you uh, shortly. I'm on the road heading out of town now. Got another set of tires. I figured since I'm going to be visiting two traders today, uh, they're not Trader Bob because I'm pretty sure I hit my cell limit on the old uh, tires. I figured it'd be a good idea just to get a couple extra tires here, get some extra uh, money uh, out of the deal. I uh, almost thought there was a zombie hiding, oh, running up behind me, but just my own, just my own, uh, what do you call it, footsteps. Got Marla here, and I did find a leather chest armor schematic. Um, I don't think I'll be making that immediately because... Ideally, I'd like to have the full set. Ooh, nice a couple jars. Another Marla. These Marlas are good to her right now because they they don't take much to hit them. And is that Mikey? Good to see you, buddy. How we doing? Still love heroes, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. Good talk, Mikey. Our painkillers, some fishing weights. It's like I get uh, like I still have a bunch of painkillers at home. It's just that uh, I I pile those up so much. It's like and I don't really use them all that all that much. And they get uh, it's just kind of one of those. They I figured take a stack, take half the stack, and then sell it. I'm just gonna take care of old Annie here with the club. There you go, sweetie. And no, no thank you, jam sandwiches. I just heading east, uh... Oh, Charlie. Why aren't moving, buddy? Sorry. Yeah, search the trash, you know. Trash is always good for... You know, potential loot. It's like, uh... Get anything from duct tape to... A lot of other stuff. Um, see even that split in the road already. Should have to go uh, explore that road, like just to see. And you know, just could do a chop up tires, but I do want to say if you enjoy my uh, content and you know you want to see more from me and you're not already subscribed, uh, then please hit the subscribe down below. It really helps the channel out a lot. But. I'm just going to continue uh, doing my thing here, uh, running up the road, and I will uh, meet you uh, once I get to the uh, first trader. So I'm coming really close to the to the trader here, and uh, really close by is uh, actually a forge house. Like I was just roaming over to take out a pig and uh, for more meat and hide, and uh, oh. See you, Annie. Gotta take care of Curly here, but I'm like, wait a minute, is that the forge house? And uh, also, I see off in the distance there, not too far away, is a uh, a desert, which is excellent news because then I'll just take your painkiller, Curly. But uh, I also see the the plains by. I'm like, yeah, this is not too far off the main road. 
Now, ideally, I would like to set up in the desert just so I can have like you know a constant source of sand for glass jars to make to make glue. You know, and like if I have a wealthy house nearby, I can just uh, I can just uh, have that as my source of water, and you know, got glue and duct tape uh, making facilities. So, if I could find a by a nice uh, place, or maybe even the forge house here. Come on, Penny. Excuse me while I deal with her here. Nice little head explosion. Like you, I could just take up temporary residence in the forge house, and I know the current house, you know, like I started a farm and everything. But it's like, that's a, that's a starter house. Uh, it's like, you know, I don't want to... It's like, I didn't want to abandon it too quickly, but... God, one of those, it's like... Desert would just be so ideal for, uh, setting up, uh... I'm just setting up production and everything, and... Just really start making bank, and it's like, not to mention we have... Two traders, uh... Close by each other. See you later, Annie. Hello, sexy. But I'm just like, I all fine for a forge house. Like, means I can have two forges. One for, uh, damn sweat. Uh, I could have uh, one for a glass, and then, you know, the glass, and maybe bullet casings and tips, and you know, for ammo production. And then, have a, then have the, uh, uh, what am I saying? Have my just typical kind of like iron and steel forge, you know, for extra per Can't have food, but I don't think I'm going to be making it back to the, uh, to the garage today. It's like, uh, I will definitely go back for it because of the, uh, I will definitely go back for it just for the, what do you call it, the, you know, the chemistry station and the forge over there, and hang on, let me just, I got sort of stuff out of here while I'm talking, but, you know, it's like, uh, would definitely help me a lot, and, uh, like I said, I'm focused on production here, but still, nice that we have an extra forge. Pick up the splinters from the door. But let's just see here, who's the... Who's the traitor to the south? Because, really would love to know. Are you serious? Traitor Bob, again. Another Traitor Bob. Ah, <sighs> well, at least, uh, you know, I dealt with him before, you know, familiar, but... <laughs> Please tell me that the Traitor to the North's gonna be at least different. You need Hi, assistance. Bob. Um... Yeah, I'm in need of assistance. Let me just make this leather. We're gonna find some more. Welcome, survivor. Feel just, free to just give around. me a second here while I uh, sell some stuff off, Maybe and next time, and I'll let you know the, the new total survivor. before uh, selling these extra sets of tires off. I've sold all the stuff now, and we're up to four thousand seven hundred twenty-two dukes. And just take a look at the secret stash real quick. Uh, see if there's anything decent at the moment. Yeah, not much. Hunting rifle schematic, crossbow schematic. I could buy those. Uh, I'm almost tempted to take the crossbow schematic. So one of those. Um, I would love to have it as an early game uh, ranged weapon that I don't have to draw. Yeah, what the heck? I'll take it. 
You come back sometime. Gotta spend some money to make some money. And see what level weapon smithing we're up to now. Weapon smithing is now level 13. Yeah, here's the desert. Sounds like got a crawler hanging out. But not too worried about him. You can see, like, just, you know, basically a limitless supply of sand to, for on offer. Awesome, a, a mining helmet. Oh, goodbye old cloth helmet. <laughs> Hello, mining helmet. I am so uh, happy to have that. Now I don't, now I can just kind of, now I can just ditch the, ditch the flashlight. It's like, oh, got to, time to sell the old flashlight off. So happy I searched that car. Yeah, this trailer's not too far, though. Just give me a second and we'll see who it is. <laughs> On my way over to the trader, I uh, found shotgun schematic and brass candlestick, and I'm just kind of trying to do some scouting to see if I can find anything. Maybe a town out here in the desert. And... What might be uh, over in the, uh, in the, in here? Uh, ooh, nice little, just more of the forest that we're, uh, we've been in, but we have Trader Joel here. Then we got, ooh, Snow Biome. Search the tree stumps for some good loot. Let's say hello to Trader Joel real quick. Trader Joel, I'm here. How we doing, buddy? I've been expecting you. Ooh, you got tasting and brewing right off the bat. Big hitter. Sell the flashlights. Sell you the tires. Back up to uh, 4300 Dukes. Um, pistol book is tempting for uh, for the, uh, to have a uh, a gun, but I think I could find that the. The beer, uh, the the beer book, tasting and brewing is very. I have to buy that because, like, uh, never know when I uh, might encounter that again. Um, but you don't. That's okay though. Like, got the. Got the. Got the. Sorry, I'm stumbling over my words. You watch yourself out there. Darn sutter, but as I was saying, you know, got the uh, tasting and brewing, and I do need to buy hop seed. All it takes is one seed to do it, but pick up the free coffee beans. Um, but it's like that opens up a whole new avenue of of revenue for me as a someone who's trying to get to a million dollars. That is a big. I'm going to search that tree stump. But yeah, that's a, that's a huge little uh, find here. Hop seed. It's like it allows me to, it's like, so basically farm farm uh, hop seeds to make a beer oh I would love to find a town out here I just so I can have a local loot source another level up see what we can spend some skill points on uh, survivor quick crafting that's just what I like doing I should have invested in a level into Palm Pete. 
But hey, it allows me to get the stuff crafted quicker and everything, so. Just gonna head back over to the, uh, the forge house and you know, see if we can set up shop over there. Now I'm back at the, uh, the forge house here, temporarily, uh, I want it to be a temporary operating base here. Ooh, first aid kit in the med uh, medicine cabinet. Specs for murky waters and more water and everything like that. Got all the stuffs jammed into the uh, um, cupboard. Uh, yeah, just want to search everything up here, you know, grab it all and. For a horde base tomorrow, I'm not going to be using the, the forge house here as a base. It's like I've used it before, and I don't want to kind of use the same thing over and over again. It gets a little bit repetitive for, uh, for content, so just paper out of the old uh, bookcase. I was hoping for something else, but oh well. Let's grab that down. Yeah, I'm really happy with this. A very nice, uh, you know, find and, you know, means you can have a second forge. The only thing I'm wanting now is just to have a, um, another town. It's like, uh, that would be kind of local to the area because, or wrong, I love the, uh, I love this town over here, yeah, but it's one of those I would rather have uh, a bunch of I guess the closest local town would actually be uh, Hub City. Uh, let me just mark it. But, you know, that I just have the cookie crumbles. I think, uh... I guess maybe I could just make expedited trips to, uh... The desert here, you know, for For sand and everything like that, just... And continue to use that local town until, uh... I'm ready to keep, uh... Ready to go for, um... Everything, uh... Sorry, I'm... Starting for words here, but you know, use it until uh, got uh, get Hub City, uh, get ready for Hub City, and then you know, maybe eventually have that be my eventual goal. But I'm going to I'm going to get some resources ready for overnight and. And I'll meet you uh, uh, if anything interesting happens on uh, overnight. Uh, until then, dirt leading up to that. And I'm on. Uh, my time is just rung, and so what I'm going to do is I'm going to build this door here, not the not the bedroll, and I'm going to put this into. I'm going to uh, make some more tools and have my tool quality overnight. Uh, so we made a. Uh, I made it. Sort of two thousand two hundred ninety-two dollars, and I have made a, well, probably went over five grand uh, before. But I did spend some money to and get the crossbow schematic and uh, the the beer uh, beer brewing book. So we're at three hundred sixty uh, three thousand six hundred eighty-five dollars. Still a pretty good day in terms of profit, and so I'm really happy with that. And you know, we got to find two of the traders, and and so I'm gonna call this episode here. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you like and subscribe, and uh, watch more of my videos if you haven't already. Take care, everybody.